welcome back to my channel i feel like my energy is a little on the rise aside today a little bit a little bit it's been i don't know it's been kind of rough and kind of like low energy for me you guys know that but i feel like that's gonna end soon just because there's been a lot going on with me in my house and i told you guys like our housing i'm sorry our house situation we don't know if we're gonna be moving i still don't know i still don't have an answer to it but somehow we're gonna figure out what we're gonna do but that's been making me kind of like depressed thinking about it and thinking about figuring out what we're gonna do it's just another stress on its own so that's what's been going on with me in my thinking but anyways good afternoon it's past 2 p.m right now or just yeah it's actually 2 p.m right now and user is right here She's filling out an application. Wow, she just got another job again. How lucky is this girl? <laughs> she keep getting like the best job in Toronto. I feel bad for people looking for jobs. <laughs> and I feel bad for people like being here and don't have like the better job. Honestly, you just have to look and be patient. And Israel like stays up every day looking for job, like applying for different kind of jobs every day. And this one that she got like has benefits, right? Oh my benefits and everything like everything pretty much and the pay is like really good like the salary wise is like really good but yeah so she got another job she's starting fresh on monday and it's also like the hours is good it's like you know monday to friday weekends off no evenings holidays off oh are you on the phone <laughs> who are you talking to TV, oh td okay sorry um yeah so um, you know it's just eight to four she'll be home by five it's like downtown i think because we live in downtown that's why it's a potluck party at my little one's school today so i signed up that i'm gonna be making food for the school which i'm gonna start right now you guys know my favorite things to make well i have a lot of favorite things to make one of my favorite things to make is fried rice so i promise my kids school that i'm gonna be cooking for them so i'm gonna be cooking for like a whole bunch of kids and chicken and fried rice so i went and bought let me show you guys uh, i went and bought this chicken this whole chicken uh, let me show you. uh i went to food basic because they have some sales going on so these are like the 15 pieces chicken and 15 chick 15 pieces chicken and so about 60 chicken it's about 60 pieces of chicken and i'm gonna be cooking some fried rice with it so i'm gonna start cooking and get ready because my daughters are like, mommy, make sure you show up on time. Bring the food on time. Yeah, we have fun. Oh, use rice on the phone, so I'm gonna keep right, so I'm gonna talk to you guys in a bit. So, um, I marinate the chicken. Here, I put some chicken broth, some chicken powder, curry, thyme, ginger, all of that goodness. And I'm gonna put it in this bag. I'm trying. I'm talking slowly because use rice on the phone with the bank. So I'm going to put it in this bag and I'm going to shake it together, mix it together, and I'm going to place it in the oven. So that's what I'm going to do now. in the bedroom okay so this is how i'm gonna be baking it just put it together in the bag and i'm gonna like mix it in and i'm gonna place it in the oven
okay my love so i just placed the chicken in the oven it's cooking right now and i'm gonna be making some fried rice we actually went out for groceries ali god what am i saying we went to buy some rice at the grocery store earlier and because rice are very heavy so we asked my husband to put it in the car and he went to school so he's gonna be coming home like around three so i'm gonna start cooking when the rice comes i'm gonna start making fried rice the rice that i have in the house right now won't be enough so i'm just gonna wait for my hubby to come bring the rice home and um i'm gonna start cooking he was on sale the rices were on sale right well they're still on sale uh food basic for like four dollars off so from twelve dollars was like seven bucks so i took like two bags and yeah oh yeah i also received yusra okay don't worry i'll do it the milk you didn't put the milk and the egg that you bought this morning in the fridge I also received some package in the mail and um, I want to open it it's probably cloth because I've been ordering lots of summer clothing for my kids I went crazy on Aliexpress like a week ago let me put the camera this way so I can see oh yeah I'll, I want to tell you guys something as well uh oh oh no everything is not in the bag this is a letter have a first day yeah, sure. Okay, I'm gonna talk to you guys in a second. Hold on. The any problem, cook with me in case like they say something. Yeah, I'm gonna help. I have to go close the door for you, Israel. Okay, guys. Um, so I was telling you guys that so I placed the chicken in the oven and um, it's cooking right now, and. The rice, like I was telling you guys, my husband um, will be bringing the rice home because he helped us pick them up at Food Basic. There's a sale going on there, like a really mass sale is going on right now, right there, right now on rices. And I think you get like half of the price off. So we bought like two bags of rice. And yeah, so right now, Israel just left to go, le to go drop off our work, you know, those bank information like all this basic information for her workplace that she just got guys she got like one of the best job like not one of them, not like the best but like i feel like a job that comes with benefit that comes with like holiday travels and all of that stuff is a good job and she's been doing so well when it comes to like applying for jobs like she never sleeps she applies she knows what she wants so she always applies for it for it so um anyway so i got this in the mail i want to open it guys like i've been shopping a lot for my kids when it comes to like the summer i think i went too hard oh what is this oh this is not my kids stuff I feel like oh this is my stuff i was like what this actually oh this is my stuff okay so my kids stuff are not here yet well some of them are here but this one is my stuff oh this is my summer robe oh guys look at how perfect this is so I bought this set from AliExpress. This is like a summer robe. And it comes with like two pants, two, sorry, two, sh one short, one pant. It's so sexy, oh my God. And the robe itself, oh, I love it. At least I can wear this this summer. It's so nice, oh my God. Look at this. And it comes with this, you know. I don't even remember the size that I took, but this is like a perfect size. And this, and I think it has like a rope. Oh, this is so nice. This is so cute. Like this, like that. I need to wear this for my husband, you know. <laughs> um, yeah, so this is what this is. I know Yusra is going to be so jealous and be like, where is mine? So, yeah. And it comes with a, like a tent top. It's hot, eh? So beautiful. This is absolutely so beautiful. I think I'm going to order more. I'm going to order more. Look at this. This is so beautiful. I'm going to actually order more. I think I ordered like two months ago. Oh, it comes with two? Oh my God. For $30. This is like for only $30, like five items for $30. Are you kidding me? And the materials, is like everything. Wow. And it also comes with like two bra pads. 
awesome i honestly i want to do like um my husband is going to rate my outfit obviously this is not going to why am i being it i order a whole bunch of stuff from everywhere from wish from aliexpress from everywhere for the summer for myself and um even from joe fresh yeah i went yesterday and i went over her not over her because i didn't buy myself any clothes for the past five years and i feel like this is the time that i want to start like you know look good my husband is here i have to look good for my husband for myself for you know and i went to joe fresh yesterday to buy something for myself and this is one of the shirts that i buy. i just bought something like this and joe fresh is like a good good quality like you can have them for years and nothing is gonna happen to like the color it's not gonna fade off so i think i spent like 270 over there and i bought a whole lot of t-shirts for myself like uh, yoga pants and stuff like that and they still have their sales it's just not as good as like the easter sales day so yeah so anyways the whole thing here that i showed you guys on aliexpress was 30 dollars how are you guys doing i want to know how you guys have been doing because it's been like a whole day like i haven't vlogged in like six days since last time i vlogged and that's because i have not been feeling any motivations to like vlog to pick up the camera like i've been thinking a lot i've been like you know there's a lot going on in my head like i told you guys my house my house situation is just bothering me like at this point i still don't have an answer if we're going to be moving or stay we love downtown we are close to down we are close to everything eating center is right there you know like everything is, we're surrounded by everything like my daughter just got a job too and it's a huge great job and she's going to be going to school we haven't really decided what we're going to do maybe we should wait another year or a year and a half i still don't have an answer my husband has a good job that he's doing right now too and everything is in downtown our life is like here so like for me i really want to move to a suburb and um you know but i don't know if we just continue to save for to next year because hubby is going to school again next year so and i just we just don't know so right now our decision is just let things happen naturally if it happens that we want to move it will just come we don't want to force anything so yeah that's the thing and yeah so i have been thinking and thinking and we have been like you know thinking about it talking about it and we still don't have an answer yet so like we said like we concluded like we're just gonna let things just happen the way we want it to be if we decided to buy a house we are going to like continue saving until we are like fully decided to like buy a house so for now we don't have an answer and we're just gonna leave it like that we're still in downtown we're still here and plus user just got a job she was telling me like she just got a job like we can just continue to save money you know she of course she eps out and hobby as well so we might even buy like a bigger house next year next two years we don't know so that's what we are doing ah i am so happy that I'm finally accepting that we are going to like let things happen naturally because I've been worrying myself my head thinking about it what we're gonna do the best decision for us and I worry I get worried a lot and it just affects me it affects me like you can tell if you know me very well, you can tell there's something bothering me if I'm talking to you and you can tell you can read it all over me and that's been happening i don't know if you guys noticed i think i said it too even in one of my videos i said like there was nothing wrong with me just that my energy is not picking up and that was part of the reason why my energy is not picking up and i'm so grateful to myself that i'm allowing myself i'm allowing nature to just you know to like to just let things happen naturally so um i'm grateful to myself because if you if i'm to, I, I wish i was talking like this yesterday or two days ago maybe i would be more better then but i wasn't talking like i would just like i feel like i was forcing things out like i want a decision i want also come to conclusions you know but i'm grateful that my my body myself it just aligned it to happen naturally i don't know how many times i said that so we're just gonna lift things like it is and just you know if it happens that we move great if it happens that we're still here great so yeah so oh, okay okay like honestly guys i'm smiling right now i haven't been smiling for the past 
for the past two weeks even that malik's birthday i was not still very very happy oh, how are you doing i know like tell me like tell me if you have like something similar to this before or you've gone through something like this before how do you deal with stuff like this i honestly want to know you guys know that i don't have anybody to like share my life with other than you guys so tell me how you deal with stuff like this like it's not like it's not like a problem it's just like a situation that it's just in the way that you just want to know so i want to know how you guys deal with stuff like this and maybe it will help me more like i'm feeling a lot better but like i just want to know how you guys deal with it okay i want to update you guys again malika's birthday is next saturday so, no not this saturday the next one after this one it's gonna be malika's birthday and we are having a party for her she want a party party so we're having like a really nice get together in a friend's condo so um my friend can't like the top roof condo place sort of so we're gonna be having like a party for her so i got event planner to like plan the whole thing it's trust me it's not a huge thing it's just something really really simple i got somebody to like decorate the hall like the decorate one part of the hall and you know make it look nice for her fifth birthday i don't know if i mentioned this in other in other vlog but yeah so and i also got like uh you know face painting um what is it called again um a clown to come you know to entertain the kids what else did we get i think my husband oh there's one more thing yeah my husband is gonna be taking care of the um sweet part like the food like the cake he ordered like one of the nicest beautiful customized cake for her and yeah so it's gonna be fun it's gonna be i just want her to feel special because malika is the kind of person that always want a party she knows what she wants even though she doesn't talk a lot she knows what she wants she's a very quiet girl but when she wants something she wanted she's like mommy i'm not going to chuck it she's like lila lila want a chuck it cheese party i want a home party I want like I want my friends to come to my party so and I respect that but we have been doing birthday parties since my kids turns one so I'm not saying God forbid there won't be any death no sickness no problems but till the till they turn 10 again we're gonna have party because every time it's like we always we always having something even the chucky cheese wasn't cheap i'm not trying to nag here he wasn't cheap even wherever you have as long as you invite more than like 10 20 people is i consider it to be party so i told them this is not gonna be our last birthday party but for now we're gonna take a break from like spending money every year and you know back to back it was Layla, this that and it comes with like present that they also want they don't understand they think that those things fall from heaven so i told her like until you are like turning 10 both of you something like that then we can have an end of birthday you know it's not like every year we have to have birthday 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 like my kids oh my gosh they just love birthday and they tell you specifically what they want you know so anyways um yeah we're gonna be having a birthday party for her and we invited about 25 kids it's gonna be so much fun i just want them to have fun to eat to enjoy to laugh to play and that place is like a very nice open place and i'm gonna carry you guys along to see hopefully i can have the energy to vlog because it's just gonna be all over the place even though i hired like event planner last year i hired a, an event planner and it was still like i could not vlog it so this year my husband is here and i want to vlog it so my nails broke when i was cleaning my stove like last week i put another paint color on it like and I was that's so disgusting. I need to go back to my technician to like re uh, make this one for me. And it was so painful. It was oh my god, and something my lips. I'm sorry, guys. I didn't realize because I put like a lip gloss since morning and it's like turning white. I'm sorry. Um, so I need to go back to my technician to refix this one for me because it doesn't look good. It looks really bad. So um, yeah, it broke and it was so painful. I've been talking for like. I don't know for like forever so yeah i'm gonna carry you guys till later so you guys can see lila malika's school party i have been watching tara edison <laughs> i feel like that's all i watched like i watched some other youtubers too but my favorite is definitely tara edison so i'm just here to check my chicken and um they're still not ready for sure and so i don't have a second like um oven tray so i put this on my 
you know they insert this one of this thing i put a foil on it and i put a chicken on it and it's still cooking so yeah you guys told me to cook in the oven so i'm baking my chicken in the oven says with tara edison like i don't know how many of you guys watched her it's just she hasn't really been posting a lot of videos just because she's uh, heavily pregnant but every time she posts videos i'm like all over it so um and i'm hungry yeah i should eat something um yeah so i'm watching her right now in a little kid <laughs> Layla. hi hi Malika. So we are in Lila school. We have child care for the little one. So let me know if you need child care. Here, here's the one. No, I know. But the little one. Yes, I'm listening. I want to show the friends our playground. Okay, show them your playground. That's amazing. So, oh. so Lila, I want to show you guys our playground. This is our playground in school, right here. And um, yeah. We always make kinetic sand. Right. Okay. We use wet sand with dry. Sand. That's your class. Mm -hmm. That's your wow. This is my baby class. Wow. Where's Lila's class? Show me. That one is Layla's class, and where's your class? That one? Wow. And then, wow. Okay. Uh, this camera is acting up. Okay, guys, so look at what we got. We got this beautiful flower from from the, the donation potluck. center. No one, what no is one, it? The yeah. Potluck. From the potluck. We got this beautiful flower. It's, um, it's like, like you pay some amount, and but then oh it's like... It's like he contributed to the school, so exactly. I gave them like some donations, and they gave us flowers. We pretty much like got this flower. I don't know, and it's so beautiful. We can, I, use, we can use it for. Spring. How can you explain this? Do you understand what she was saying yeah. about the flower? Yeah. So it's like you contribute. It's like um, the contribution goes towards the school, and it's like you cherish the flower. You put some money down. I don't know how it works, but anyway. We were the ones to take the flower home and some people already put like a lot of money down even more than me But like they didn't take the flower but like I feel like we're the last person to like contribute it and then we're taking the flower home and I'm so um, Happy I love flowers anyways, so we're just leaving the school now Going home. No, we're leaving the potluck And I'll someone hide our chicken Someone hide our chicken Open it. Our whole bunch of kids. Come on, quick. Um, Malik, we went to the last school to, um, for the potluck. Yeah. So I just unwrap, unravel the flower and I'm gonna put it in a flower pot. I think it's so beautiful. It, it comes with this uh, vase. And look at this. I'm always, I'm obsessed with flowers. I'm gonna put this in my bedroom. What happened? I know, you better, you better, you're not wearing this. I kept it and I found it and you're not wearing it. It's going right in the garbage. I found my leaky earrings. What you so it's not. I'm not talking to you, sunshine, I'm talking to Malik. Anyway, I'm obsessed with my flower. What's so rude? You said you're gonna take something that's not rude if I put something in the garbage that doesn't mean it's rude it can be it can be something that is not good and I put it in the garbage um yeah so that's this is what it looks like I, I don't think I've ever gotten a flower like this I think I've always gotten like a plain flower roses Malik is hungry okay guys so I need to tell you guys so the food that we took to Lila Malika mm. school for the potluck our food was pretty much the best everybody was commenting me about the fried rice and the chicken and um what else i was gonna say and the chicken they didn't even serve it to the kids i think all the teachers eat the kiki thank god i took the chicken there all of the teachers ate the chicken and i think some parents as well oh this camera is just messing up yeah so yeah now malik, malik came home starving and here's his food 
This is a stabbing fist. This is a stabbing fist. Malik doesn't want you guys to see his hair because daddy cut his hair off uh, two weeks ago. So that's why he's covering his face. That's not Malik real face. This is another version of Malik. Maybe Mommy. next two months. Mommy. Malik, I'm showing your head now. Mommy. <laughs> you gave up? Mommy. Yes, sunshine. Can I eat? No, you're not hungry. What, Leila? Just joking, Daniel. Hey. She add pizza. No, it's still hot. It's still hot. Are you sure? I feel. Okay, hey guys. So I just finished Malika's uh, numbers. She's been studying numbers for the past um, weeks now, and she's been doing great. Like she's been doing very, very well. I'm so proud of her. She has come a long way with her numbers. So yeah, I just finished that with her, and um, I'm gonna do. I really want to do like a mommy night routine. And I'm going to do that tonight. So I'm going to end this vlog here. Hubby just left to work. Well, he left like a while ago. So I'm going to end it here. And because I want to relax, it's about 7 right now. My night routine usually starts like around this time. So I'm going to do the night routine for you guys. And you guys should be expecting that in, in, in I almost say in the mail. You guys should be expecting that in your mail. <laughs> so yeah, you guys should be expecting that coming up and yeah or if it comes before this video i will always link it down you guys can check it out so yeah that's what i'm gonna go do now i want to say thank you so much i don't think i cover a lot today but that's okay that's okay because um there's nothing really exciting right now Yusra is over there she is um doing stuff on the computer no 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 take off your chicken from my shirt Yusra. yeah She's over there, she's doing stuff on a computer and Malika is eating chicken yeah. that I made for them earlier. So anyways, I'm gonna end the vlog now. Thank you so much for watching. If you yeah. haven't subscribed, oh. please subscribe and thumbs up. I will catch you guys in my next video. God bless you all and bye-bye.